Okay. So I left my car at my friend's house last night. And I needed to go get it back. Figured I'd walk there. Film some stuff. It's kind of beautiful out today. All right. Okay. Just making sure the quick capture works on my GoPro here. I have absolutely no plan on where I'm going right now. I'm just kind of walking from point A to point B. If I see some cool things along the way, I'll show you. I'm sure there'll be something. Also for, ooh, also for anybody who's curious as to where I'm going right now. Um, I'm, right now I'm in Manor Heights or Sunnyside. I don't know what this neighborhood is even called really. Um, I live right over by Wagner High School. That's Wagner High School off in the distance. But I'm walking over to Richmond Town. Not like Richmond Town, Richmond Town, like the cool old buildings and stuff, but you know, like the neighborhood Richmond Town. That's where my friend lives. And I am on a quest to go get my car. Did I remember my keys? Okay, we're good. Here's a question. Is Richmond Town considered the South Shore? Because, and for anybody not from Staten Island, there's like an, there's like an unofficial North Shore and, and South Shore of Staten Island. And, you know, I do a lot of videos in the North Shore because I live in the North Shore. And I've had a lot of people ask me like, man, how come you never go to the South Shore? And it, it, it's simply that. It's just like when I have free time, like I'm kind of lazy. So I just go to the places that are closest to me. You know, but I have sort of been to the South Shore on on this series, on this YouTube series. Um, if you go check out my my Christmas light special, all the houses with like the nicest lights on Staten Island, they were all in the South Shore, except for West Brighton. I went to West Brighton, and they had like, oh wait, they had a uh, a whole bunch of nice lights there, you know, but. A lot of the Tottenville houses and Princess Bay houses had like the nicest lights I've ever seen. But yeah, I'll make sure to go actually check out some neighborhoods over there and some cool things. Got a lot of requests for the conference house, which sadly I've been I've lived on Staten Island for 30 years and I went to the conference house for the first time about a year and a half ago. Um, but yeah, we'll do that. Hey guys, that's my gym. I work out here. Yeah. And by workout, I mean I sometimes show up here and do some things and then don't come back for four days and then do it again and then don't come back for six days and then do it again and then forget that I have a membership there and then go back and say I'm going to do it every day and then go back and don't come back for four days. And you guys know the routine. All right, so right about here is where it starts to feel like old Staten Island or what I would imagine would be old Staten Island because this is where the this is where the sidewalk runs out on Manor Road, you know, just past the JCC. Um, yeah, definitely shouldn't walk down this way. Um, I'm a trained professional, so I'm going to do it, but yeah. And it's really kind of nice over here because it's like this is like this is like one of the last back roads on Staten Island. If you didn't know any better, if 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 you were blindfolded and they took the blindfold off and they put you right here, you would think you were upstate. You know, you would think you were in like a country town. So I kind of I kind of like that part of this of this street. Just wanted to get a shot of that. Pouch camp. I made an episode where I walked through the trail here. It's a good spot for anybody who is ever a Boy Scout on Staten Island. Or really anywhere. I know people from all over the city come to Pouch Camp, so yeah. And this is just like the coolest spiderweb I've ever seen in my life. I hope you guys can see it. I'll do one of these. The only thing that stinks about these GoPros is that you don't know if people see anything until you go edit it. All right. All right. Off in the distance. 
There's a little deer. Where's he going? Where'd you go? There he is. Hold on. Hold on. I don't know if you guys could see him. I can. He just ran away from me. Come on, bud. I ain't gonna hurt you. My plan in life... My plan in life is... One day when I'm older and I'm retired, I'm gonna go around Staten Island and cut off all the deer tags and collars they've been putting on the deer. That is the most atrocious thing I've ever seen. I'm not much of a activist, but if there's one thing I don't agree with, it's that we put huge yellow tags clipped into the deer's ears and put a collar around them and then let them go about their day. Also, the owners of this house, How much? How much for me to live there? Huh? They're kicking me out. They're making me move to New Jersey because I can't afford a house here. All right? You are the luckiest people to have one of the last houses in the middle of the woods on Staten Island. Hey, you guys too, man. How much? You know? Name your price. Also, talk about deer with tags. You can kind of see them. I hope these people don't step out and shoot me right now, but... Ah, man, they ran away. Hey, boys, girls, I'm not sure. I think those are does. You know? You walk in just like... 10 feet. This is like... You could camp here, you know? Okay, so I'm finally approaching the end of Manor Road. This is where Manor meets Rockland, you know? Um, if you look over there, now you can't even see it, but that's where Moses Mountain is. Um, basically just a man-made dirt mountain that they created where they needed to put, when they were building the Staten Island Expressway, they needed a place to put all the dirt that they dug up. And so they just dumped it right over here behind me, off Manor Road. And it got so big, they decided to call it a mountain. Moses Mountain. I don't know who Moses is. I'm not sure if they're, you know, talking about the guy from the Bible. But, yeah. I just want to go get a picture of the sign that says Moses Mountain. All right, well, they used to have, like, an old-school New York City Parks Department sign. But this is the sign they have now. Most people at the top, that's the outlook that you could see. Maybe one day I'll go up there. Not today, I gotta get my car, but one day I'll go up there. Um, if you ever decide to go up there, wear high socks and long pants and tuck your pants into your socks and wear bug spray. I walked in there one time and I walked out with more ticks than I've ever seen in my entire life. So I gotta go that way, but like, Manor Road is pretty dangerous to walk down, but Rockland Avenue, like, you might as well just go to a lawyer and get a will, because you will die if you walk down there. So, I think there's another route that I'm going to look for right now. I used to see the kids from Farrell always running in there, so I'll let you know if I'm successful. All right. I found it. Look at me. It's marked by this little, these little check marks for anybody who... Is looking for it. Yeah, little trail through the woods. Awesome. This should take me to over by what's that street? Is that Amboy? No, that's not Amboy. What's that street that goes to Amboy? All right, we'll we'll find out soon. Just wanted to show you guys this as well. If you walk down a little bit, it's a nice little creek. That runs through Staten Island. This is right off Rockland. You know? You probably look to the right and don't even notice it most of the time, but there it is. Hey, another love tree. I saw one of the. Whoa. Looks like something lives in there, but. Okay. Yeah, I saw one of these in Club Lakes. I'm sure they're everywhere. Um, JM and DA from 1994. Hope you guys got married and having a nice life. 
Terenia WT MH WN look at all these people look at all these people all right 08 07 97 wow that's a really cool one hope you guys are all still together hey man look at that little wooden bridge okay so let's document this in case i fall you guys can have a good laugh okay all right okay yeah i made it i love things like that please whoever is in charge of like building things on staten island uh less attached houses and more wooden bridges over creeks please thank you all right cool i made it look at that boulder all right so looks like i gotta walk a little bit in the danger zone but i cut out like 80 percent of it so that's good all right if i don't make it mom i love you okay the beautiful safety of a sidewalk I made it, people. Okay, so quick public service announcement for my fellow Staten Islanders and people all across the world. This right here, this is a trash can. That's where trash goes. Okay? I believe in you. You can do it. Anybody who's watched my past episodes knows I'm a sucker for wall murals. And this is a nice one that I pass all the time. Muna Oman. All right. Hope you're on Instagram. I'm gonna go check, check out your work later. Okay, so it's Rockland and Richmond Road. That's this corner. I don't know why I thought it was Amboy. Amboy's at the end of Richmond Road over there, but yeah. I used to go that way all the time when I would go to Farrell High School. Right on Amboy, and there it was. All right, we're getting closer. Here it is. We're in Richmond. We're the town of Richmond. All right. Like I said, not like the old school Richmond town, but you know, the neighborhood. All right. These people definitely think I'm crazy. Okay, so I've driven down the street 8,000 times in my life and I've never seen this camel here You people are awesome. I love it All right, and this is where I make my turn. I know once I see St. Patrick's That it's time one thing I will say I knew this walk was going to be long But this is a long walk <laughs> Glad I did it though. This was fun. I gotta say, Richmond Town, what a beautiful neighborhood. It's very quiet over here. When I, when I move back to Staten Island, I'm gonna be looking out for some houses over here. What would my videos be without a squirrel come to say hello? What's up, bud? Don't attack me. Okay, okay, don't hurt me. All right, goodbye, see ya. Sheesh, man, they don't like me. I love them and they don't like me. Okay, Clark Avenue. I'm getting close. There it is, that's where I'm going. All right, Cotter Avenue, I made it. Only another mile walk up the street to my car, but I made it. Nico. Move closer to my house, please. All right. I've made it to my car. I knew I could do it. At certain points, I was a little worried, but my legs held up. You know? Yeah. That was cool. That was a nice walk. Let's do it again sometime.